Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of How to Make Drinks at Home When You're Stuck at Home. Today we're taking on one of the great brunch classics of all times, uh, the French 75. So this drink was invented during World War I. It was named after the French 75 millimeter artillery gun. Um, the story uh, goes that it was popularized by American and French soldiers in Paris during that time and then it was later uh, picked up by a New York City bartender who wrote it into a book and that's kind of what led to it being um, a widely known beverage. Um, this is a great brunch choice. Like I said, this goes great with eggs, French toast, whatever. So the next time you're having brunch with your husband, wife, best friend, whatever, um, this is a nice one to uh, give a try. So we're going to do a subtle variation on this and I'll explain that in a minute. Uh, we've got four main elements in this. We've got gin, we're using Hendrix. Sugar, or in this case, simple syrup, lemon juice, and then of course, champagne. So this drink is often made in a champagne flute, like this one. I'm not going to use that because I hate champagne flutes. They're too small uh, and they break too easily. So instead, we're going to make it in a nice big wine glass. And part of the reason we're going to do that is we're going to put cracked ice into this drink. Now, I know that might sound like heresy to some people, but this is actually catching on in France. Um, and I looked into this and the good people at Moet have actually said it's totally legit to do. Um, and like most cocktails, it does benefit from being a little bit colder. So no further ado, we're gonna dive right in. We're gonna start off with an ounce and a half of gin. This is gonna go into our ice filled cocktail shaker. Then we're gonna do three quarters of an ounce of simple syrup. That goes in. Three quarters of an ounce of lemon juice. I, I squeezed that before end because it always takes me too long to do. And we're gonna shake this up nice and hard. Now we're gonna add the champagne. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add it right into the shaker. Oh yeah, that's it. Ah, oh, there we go, nice. So we're gonna do three ounces of the champagne. That's three total ounces of the champagne. And since obviously we can't shake this now, we're gonna do like we did with the um, a few other drinks. We're just gonna give it a little stir. All right, now here comes the heresy. We're gonna put cracked ice into our big, beautiful wine glass. There we go. And we're gonna strain in our French 75. Doesn't that look nice with the ice? It just looks better. There we go. Uh, and then I cut a nice long lemon peel. You could put it in like that, or if you want, you can fancy it up just a little bit. Get a little slice on either side. The kind of person who likes the, uh, the crust cut off, you might go for this. And then we're just gonna Slide that right in there. And there you go, French 75. Awesome brunch drink. Enjoy. Oh, that's good. <laughs> 